Hi there Aquarius, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl and we are looking at November 28th through December 4. And we are finally starting the ascent, descent into the last couple of weeks of 2016 and what a year it's been. We're getting towards the end and with Mercury going out of phase one more time in Mercury on uh, December 19, it's definitely a time when we have to make sure that we get all of our ducks in a row before that happens. Like the political thriller television series Scandal, the Sagittarius New Moon on Tuesday, November 29 is connected and not in such a good way to the planet Neptune. With Neptune squaring the new moon, this week can be a time when a moral acts about people in high places are in the news. While everyone loves to dish dirt, make sure it's not about you. The first day of December dawns sunny and bright in the social realm with a trine in air signs between Mars in Aquarius and Jupiter in Libra. So Librans and Sagittarians and other Aquarians are really, really good matches for you at this time. Things get serious on Friday, December 2nd when Mercury moves into Capricorn for the second time this year. Rational, dry and uber organized Capricorn dictates that from now on until the end of the year, it's time for you to focus on final outcomes and bottom lines with no time or uh, acceptance of lame excuses. You can lighten things up if you remember. Mercury in Capricorn is also known for its wry wit and ironic sense of humor. So as we look at the rest of December and see what's happening in, on a broader spectrum, you've got Mars, the planet of energy and action in your sign through the end of the year, which is fabulous. The universe has arranged a wonderful month for you full of warm gatherings that include long distance friends and relatives that you haven't seen in quite a while. Mars in your sign will keep things exciting and give you the energy to keep up with a busy social life and loving affectionate Venus will help him out as of December 7 because he's moving into she's moving into your sign as well so it's a very passionate month for those of you who are in a fairly new relationship you could find yourself engaged this year sometimes these things happen you know you hear those stories of people who meet and they just know and within three four months they're engaged think Mariah Carey and James Packer and think that didn't work out so well, but they're not ordinary people. So this is definitely a time when you could feel swept off your feet. Now, if you do, go with it, enjoy it, embrace it, because he or she could definitely be the one. Once Venus enters your sign December 7, the fun will really start. The charm, This charming energy will attract positive, optimistic people who share your core beliefs. She might also introduce you to someone special through a friend of a friend or a family member who's been insisting you meet. Go ahead. Tis the season for socializing. Have a great week. Great speaking to you. And I'll be speaking to you again next week.